Hello there, Golfreak here, and welcome back to another Let's Play of Civilization V. Um, well, so this is what's going on. Um, I've graduated high school, so that's great. Uh, I won't have a lot of free time in the future, and right now all I want to do is play video games. So I'm probably just going to spam videos and process them as fast as I can, and then get them out as fast as I can. So you can expect to have a lot of content out for me, even more than usual. And, uh, yeah, so I might actually be done with this game way before you see this video. Heck, if, I, if all goes well, I might have two games done by this time if my hard drive can hold out. Which actually reminds me real quick. Just keeping this out so that I can see if I'm going to get full. But I should be fine for about 10 hours of videos, if not more. So anyway, who am I going to play as? Well, I want to play as someone I haven't played as yet. But let's take a look and see what... Um, what civs, what the bonuses are. Um, Washington, America Manifest Destiny. All land military units have plus one sight and a 25% discount when purchasing tiles. This is useless. I almost never purchase tiles. I, I focus mainly on culture to do that. So that's not worth anything. And all land military units have plus one sight, which can be good in military conquest, but that's just not good overall. And they have the B 17 bomber, which dropped a nuke in real life, and the Minutemen. So overall, Washington is not good. And I haven't played as Montezema. Gains culture for the Empire for each enemy unit killed. That's not bad. And they also have the Floating Gardens, which is not going to tell me what it is. But um, that wouldn't that might not be bad to do. Elizabeth, Sun Never Sense, plus two movement for all naval units. I think that's changed. But I never I never really liked. Um, I, I never go for naval. I usually try to go for land. And I'm planning to play on a on a Pangea map anyway, so that's not going to be too good. Um, Napoleon plus two culture per turn from cities before discovering steam power. That could be really, really good, actually. Um, but I really like to get technologically advanced, so that's not too great because it goes away after a while. Uh, Bismarck, 50% um, chance that you earn 25% gold and they join your side. I really don't like that because then that gives more strain on the economy. And it, it wants you to essentially take out barbarians, but at the same time, if you do that, you start straining your economy, which is not good. Alexander, city-state influence degrades half the and at half recovers at twice the normal rate. That really is not too bad. Um, that might be. So, I'm just looking down. I got some other people I haven't done. You know, I'm gonna go for a culture victory, and I want it to be a little bit domination as well. So we're gonna go ahead and go with Montezuma of the Aztecs. And actually, you know what we're going to do is we're going to have it on a standard map, but instead of a Pangea, we're going to do a random map type. Um, I really do not care for that, so a lot of policy saving, a lot of promotion saving, and we want quick combat to speed it up. So, yeah, alright, that seems good. Let's begin. Welcome, O Divine Montezuma. We grovel in awe at your magnificence. May the heavens shower all manner of good things upon you all the days of your life. You are the leader of the mighty Aztec people, wandering nomads from a lost home in the north, who in the 12th century came to live in the Mesa Central in the heart of what would come to be called Mexico. Surrounded by many tribes fighting to control the rich lands surrounding the sacred lakes of Texcoco, Haltocan and Zampungo, through cunning alliances and martial prowess, within a mere 200 years, the Aztecs came to dominate the Central American Basin, ruling a mighty empire stretching from sea to sea. The empire at last fell under assault from foreign devils, accursed Spaniards, wielding fiendish weapons the likes of which your faithful warriors had never seen. O oh, great King Montezuma, your people call upon you once more to rise up and lead them to glory. Bring them wealth and power and give them dominion over their foes and rivals. Will you answer their call, glorious leader? Will you build a civilization that will stand the test of time? All right, so the Jaguar, a fairly weak early game military unit, only the asset can build it. The unit fights more effectively in jungle and heals damage when it kills an enemy unit, unlike the warrior, which, oh, it actually heals when you kill someone, that's cool. And the Floating Gardens is, 
Each workplace tile provides plus two food. Ooh. So that looks like it's a... Must be, so it replaces... It looks like it replaces the watermill, but it might be might be uh, a building on top of that, though, because it could be built next to a lake as well. So that's interesting. Um... So, yeah, we're going to go ahead and begin. And I said I was going to go for a culture victory. Well, that's not quite accurate. What I'm doing is I'm playing like I normally always play, but I'm going to lean towards that if I can. And I'm not... Oh, that's a lake tile down there. And we have a river right here, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, we have a river here. Sweet. So that's good. So that's, I thought this was ocean. I was mistaken. Um, but that's good. We have a river and everything, so we can get our special building. We have two different luxury resources as well. Uh, Jaguar. Uh, we'll have you explore up this way. Marble. Too far away, though. We might want to settle a city over here. Um, we're get a scout going. And our research will be animal husbandry. Let's see if we can get any horses. Queued up. Hmm. Actually, you know what? I've changed my mind. I want to be scientifically progressive. Or aggressive, whatever you want. So I'm going to rush writing, actually. And... And then we're going to get... Then we're going to get animal husbandry. Then the calendar. And then we're going to go down and get iron working. I think. That might be what we do this game. Well, I can change that at any time. Come in here. Okay. Next turn. Ruins! Excellent. Okay, let's grab them. And we get some stuff. Oh, your natural wonder. Okay, so we might want a city up here on this river as well. We have a spearman now, which is okay. Not great. Only a little bit stronger. But I guess I could count for a lot. Oh, more ruins. Nice. So let's grab these. No, we got some population. Nice. We're going to have you come down this way. And I'm not going to need a worker for a little while because I'm going mainly science right now. So we're going to build one more scout first. That'd be good. We can get more area ex explored. I'm keep on coming down this way. Oh, city-state and coast. Interesting. Oh, and coast right here. Ooh, this could be good. If I'm if this is all coast, then that means I'm on the lower half of whatever kind of shape this is, but I have no idea what it's like, so we shall see. And we meet Hanoi. Cool. Let's have you go back up this way then. And you come over here. More cotton down here. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, that's just a ton of cotton and a ton of wheat. Well, that might not be a bad location if I have enough happiness. We shall see. Shall the clay say to him? Okay, so we got that. So we come up here. Oh, we got some barbarians. We might be able to take them out. We're the Aztecs, after all. We want to take some stuff out. So, okay. So it looks like we are on the lower half of our continent, which is really nice. And ruins. Sweet. Um. 
Granary would not be a bad thing right now. Let's see, 14 turns for a worker. How long until I get animal husbandry? Because that'll be the first thing I want. 19 turns. Okay. Yeah, so... Well, if I, if I build the granary, you'll grow faster and you should produce more. Let's go ahead and get that. Then. We'll start this anyway, and we'll see. Have you come on over here. And you are going to come up here. Okay, grab those ruins. We got calendar? Heck yes! So teach us to know. Wow, that was nice. Next turn. Minor defeat, but they're really heavily fortified. Let's go ahead and attack. Wow, that was way more damage than it should have done. Should have been a minor defeat, not a major one. Jeez. More ruins. Yeah, you definitely need to heal. And go pick these up. 30 culture. Excellent. That's what we want. And we've met Catherine. Приветствую тебя, незнакомец. You are as intelligent and, and sensible as you are attractive. We shall get along famously. Um, I guess I'm not wearing a shirt, but okay. Uh, that's kind of weird. Okay, adopt a policy. We're gonna go grab tradition again. I love tradition now. I love what they how, they, how much they've changed it up. It's really good now. So, next policy in seven turns, too. That's great. And the granary is being built faster, which is nice. We have a city state over here, so we're going to want to settle. We're not going to want to settle near this river then, because then we won't have a lot of tiles. We might want to go around the other side, but anyway. We met Bucrest, who's cultured. Nice. Bucrest. I'm going to say Bucrest. And by the way, my pronunciation of words is probably horribly miscued. I don't look up stuff, so, you know, however I say it is how I, is, you know what I mean, essentially. Let's get, you need to keep on exploring around here. Tab, you come up here. And we meet Egypt. I don't have anything to trade yet. Now we're meeting everybody. It's starting to look a little bit like a continent map. Oh, there's another warrior back there. Now if you come up here. Oh, and this is where you are. Oh, you're going to get that gold. There's not a lot of luxury resources. But, I think a city right around here wouldn't be too bad. We'll see. We're going to have you instead come over here. Because I want to see if there's anyone... Oh, we got some barbs. Interesting. Okay, we're gonna have you up here. Oh, nice start. That's unfair. Next turn. He who okay, we got writing. We'll go ahead and finish that greenery. Let's just have you scout. I don't think they'll attack. I think they do. Oh well. And there's sugar up here. I don't have sugar. So, I'm seeing a city right here. That would be good. OK, 
Okay, we're gonna have you scout past their city just in case that's where Egypt is, because I'm not sure where Egypt is. Here. Oh, it is. And they have an incense too. Jeez, that was a good start. Um, We'll have you come over here. Well, we want you to be healed, so go ahead and heal. No, I actually cleared it out. Took a little damage, but got some culture and some health out of that, so that's good. Uh, we're gonna get legalism from our culture. My next policy is in a little bit, not too long, thankfully. Next turn. Let's see if they'll attack me. Yep, okay, you get promoted. Get a drill and take them out. Some more culture going in. That's good. Finish the granary. We need the worker. You can come up here. Oh, crud. Right when we find everyone's, and they're going to get it. Yep. Bummer. Okay, we're going to have you heal. Because we're going to need you to clear out the area. There's marble over here, too. I guess right here would be the best place to get access to this. And the marble. And the ocean and the fish. So that would be a great place for a city. It's a little bit far away. But we shall see how this all turns out. Okay. Oh, wow. They actually roadblocked you, eh? Okay, we're going to have you come all the way down here, then. And this is a different... I'm just playing this uh, start a little bit different from... Oh, we can, we can do open borders. We'll do that. Um, I need to check to see who else has gold. Oh, we have horses. Good. That's good to know. Um, lots of mountains over here. My goodness. Well, if if Bismarck's over here, which he could be, that might not be a bad route to take because I can probably uh, get him inside of like a trap him or something. I don't know. We'll see. Because I don't want to be like purely pacifistic in this game. We're gonna see how this goes. Just kind of like, if I see an advantage, I'll take it. Yeah, this is probably where they came from. But I like this mountain range here. Yeah, I, I, I don't know. We'll see. I do lots of elephants. I'm not, I usually have a worker by now, but I'm just trying to see, trying to focus more on city growth and culture and city growth and maybe considering culture right now before I get that going, which is not bad, really. I just have a lot of stuff to do because I have a lot of tech. And there's Germany. city here would be sweet. But yeah, we're gonna need to hurry up, because this seems to be like Catherine can come over here too, so... Oh, really? You're walking straight through their borders. You're annoying. Okay, we're going to have you deal with these barbs. Um, we do want you in a... Is it forest or jungle? Jungle only. Um, none of these are... That's so what I'm going to have you come over here to this hill. You can just keep coming around here. Oh, wow, this is actually a larger landmass than I thought it was.
The meek shall inherit the earth. All right, so we're getting some good tech incoming. Scouts are probably going to get attacked. Yep. Let's finish them off. Oh, that was a lot of damage. We got some culture out of that, so that's not bad. Oh, and I totally forgot about the gold. You heal. Um, let's see who's got 50 gold. You've got, you both have plenty of gold. Uh, 50 gold. Open borders. Oh my gosh, so, essentially, I'll give you open borders and 10 gold. Um, no, how about 40 gold then? No, that's still totally unfair for me. Wow. Do you really, you're neutral. You just really don't want my open borders then. Okay. Border. No. 50. Open borders. Oh my gosh, you too, eh? Cocked. That's dumb. 380. Yeah, it's going to be a while till we get there. Plus, it's going to be even longer now that I have a worker. Egad. I got attacked. Oh, here's Egypt. Now we're gonna, yeah, we're gonna do our happiness tiles first. And our spearmen will take out these guys. Uh, choosing production. We finished the worker. Let's go ahead and build a jaguar to protect our city. Adopt policy. Uh, we're not building any wonders at the moment. So I'm gonna get land elite. We want our city to grow. Okay, you need to heal. You build the pasture. You heal as well. Ooh, we got gold over here. Hello. So, here and here would not be a bad location. So we really kind of need to hurry up and get those. That'll be four cities overall. That'll be good. Okay, we're going to have you clean this guy up. Next turn. Good, keep on growing. Here, heck okay, we have bronze working. Iron work is going to take a lot. So let's get something else instead. What do we want? Uh, we want the wheel. We're going to get that once we get a little bit more science going. Okay, I'm going to have you get this. This over here. Um, we got this Jaguar built. We want this city. Let me say right over, right around here. Mm. Yeah, right around here is where we want this next city. You're fully healed, good. Um, hmm, 10 turns until a new citizen is born, won't grow at all if I do that, build me the lot, oh, you're getting some gold, per, good gold per turn, uh, build Stonehenge, actually, uh, how long till I get the next policy, 20 turns, eek. Um, I want to go ahead and get, well, 
a culture per turn would be quite nice. But I think I need one more city first. So we're going to do that. I got five population in the city, which is fine. Minor victory. Go ahead. Okay, but. Hmm, natural wonder in a city state border. That's interesting. Okay, you're fully healed. Keep on exploring. We meet Singapore. Okay, build the plantation. And finish them off, you'll get healed. Yeah, so you didn't take ten technically you like took no damage. And that should cut down our culture by one turn. And you can come up here. And we're going to give you the medic promotion because that one is awesome and you can heal. Some barbs incoming, not surprising. Uh, alert. Yeah, let's work together. Good. I want to. And I know I'm not. Some people aren't too keen about doing that because then you have to do stuff for them, give them stuff. Uh, to maintain any kind of relation, but they're more willing to trade with you. So it is better. Um, you. Minor defeat? My strength is... How is my strength 5 point... Oh, there we go. Oh, that was weird. I must have been on, like, the other guy, the minor victory. Good. Okay. Can I not move to here? Nope. Okay, just alert then. We met Geneva. Okay, we're going to have you instantly heal. And just keep on alerting. Ooh, someone, it looks like Bismarck's got a settler stolen or something. Wisdom and virtue. Okay, got the wheel built. Good. You really need to get up here real fast. I want to city up here because I definitely want this area over here. No reason I attacked them because I want some culture. Oh, it actually helps me with Singapore as well. Choose research. No. Um, Philosophy, I guess. Um, get rough terrain. And just heal here until the settler comes. And yeah, you just fortify until healed there. Maybe you can get some more XP coming in or something. I don't know. You're afraid of me. New. Okay, you're friends with Germany. Everyone's being friendly. Okay, you. We want you. If you're gonna come this way anyway, just move to here until you meet up with my Jaguar. 
Um. I want all of these buildings like right now. Um. Okay. This will give me more production and more food, more city growth, which is good. We want that. So we're going to build the floating gardens first. I'll probably wait until I can buy the library. I'm going to buy that ASAP and then work on Stonehenge or something else. Uh, so you want open borders. I want money. Seriously? Um, 40. You're afraid of me and you're not willing to do this. Now see, that's a ripoff for me. So I guess straight up open borders. What? You the one that offered it? Well, that's a glitch in the AI or something. Jeez. Um, I don't like the fact that you are there. You move here first. It's better if you're attacked. Ugh, I might just take you all because you're being so annoying. Oh, actually, I do have the strongest military. Not anymore. I just lost a unit. Oh, well, that means more gold per turn. Get over there. Do nothing. Ooh, look where you are. Let's wipe you out. Oh, seriously? Okay, we're going to have you go on the sheep. Alright, it's turn 50. I'm going to cut the video off here. Thank you very much for watching, and God bless.